Hey guys, Rick from Rally Sport Direct here. Behind me, we've got our Focus ST. In front of me, I've got the Mishimoto Oil Cooler Kit specific for the Focus ST. Now, I've taken it all out of the box just because this thing comes incredibly well packaged and pers to preserve time, I figure it might be best just to do that. So, I don't even know where to start. Let's go ahead and start with the thermostatic oil uh, adapter or oil plate adapter, whatever you want to call it. So. If uh, your Focus is your daily driver, which I'm guessing most of you uh, it is, I would highly recommend going with a thermostatic uh, oil sandwich plate. Main reason is you want to get the engine up to temp, you want to get the oil up to temp, and this thermostat won't open until a set temperature, then the oil starts to flow through the oil cooler. Uh, without it, it's going to take your oil a very long time to get up to temperature, uh, which can be a problem, especially during the winter or on cooler days. Uh, so having a thermostatic oil plate is essential. Now they do sell it in a non-thermostatic oil plate, um, but definitely opt for the thermostat in there. And as you can see, it's gold, beautiful CNC aluminum Mishimoto logo on it. Even has a, a little port here that's plugged if you wanna install either oil temperature or a uh, oil pressure sensor there, which is very cool. All right, moving on, you have some nice heat wrap to keep everything, all the temperatures under control under the hood. All of your AN fittings, which are anodized black. Very cool. All of the hardware you're gonna need to install it. Two brackets. Uh, one cool thing about this bracket is I like how it kind of mimics the factory honeycomb grill. Nice little touch uh, from Mishimoto. Does come with the oil lines itself that are all pre-cut to length with the AN fittings installed. If you've ever had to work with uh, stainless steel oil lines, it can be a pain, so we are very thankful that they uh, install those from the factory. And last but absolutely not least, we've got the core. And right here. And of course, that's got the Mishimoto M on it, and this is going to go in the upper grill of the car to get a good amount of airflow in it. Now, one problem we might have uh, is we've got a very tall and very large front mount intercooler installed on this car already. I don't necessarily see it being an issue. We might have to bend the brackets a little bit just to get it to fit. Uh, Mishimoto does warn of this uh, in their instructional video on how to install this. So just be aware that if you do have an aftermarket intercooler, uh, you might have to do a little bit of additional work to get it to fit. But um, I'm excited for this. This car actually sees some decent amount of track time. Granted, it's winter here now. We're not really having to worry about it now, but we're basically prepping this car for next summer. And I'm very excited to get this installed. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it.
we've just installed the Mishimoto oil cooler on our Focus ST. A couple things I wanted to talk about mainly was the installation. As you saw in the video, we had to make a custom bracket. The reason for that is we have a massive Process West intercooler on the car currently, which did not allow us to mount the oil cooler in the same way that Mishimoto wanted us to. Now, that's no fault of Mishimoto's. Uh, really their brackets and their mounting solution was genius as far as uh, on the front of this car, but unfortunately we weren't able to do that. Uh, we've, we're pretty happy with our mounting. Of course, I wish we could have used those Mishimoto brackets. It would have looked a lot better, um, but that's quite all right. Uh, and then next thing I wanted to talk about uh, in regards to the installation was the actual sandwich plate adapter. That is a very tight fit down there. Um, getting a one inch wrench on, a, on those AN fittings is a little bit difficult, but not too bad. Give yourself about two hours for this install, maybe a little bit longer depending on how fast you can uh, you can get this car apart. Uh, other than that, really wasn't bad. Now, performance-wise, it's winter here. It's probably about 25 degrees outside, so we can't really test the oil cooler in the way that we want to, but come summertime, once we get this car out on track, we'll be able to test it. Hopefully, we can keep our oil temps down uh, and keep this car rocking out on track a little bit longer. Uh, if you have a Focus ST, you're looking for an oil cooler, you track your car, or you just drive aggressively in the summertime, uh, I would highly recommend the Mishimoto oil cooler. It is a fantastic product through and through, very well designed. Anyway, that's all the time we've got for you today. Thanks for checking us out. We'll see you next time.